Around the bend. Let's go. Cheers. Ah, <laughs> uh, goes down smooth. Now, you should notice you feel a little empowered, right? Maybe a little freer? Or if you have eyeballs, you'll notice you have an extra choice floating around in your brain. Yes, it could be said that you are now unshackled from previous concerns of societal appropriateness. Sounds just like college. But be careful what you order. Different drinks affect people different ways. Like, you know, for instance... Hey, Jim Jum! What the fu- What the shit is that you got on your head? <laughs> uh, sir, I'm not, uh, Jim Jum. Ah, sure you are, Jim Jum. <laughs> Why, I even called you, you last, uh, yesterday morning? Uh, buddy, we don't know any Jim Jum, okay? You got the wrong guy. Remember that, that dance man when you scored all those points in the, uh, the, the wheelbarrow? What? Come on, guys. This is a prime opportunity here to really utilize your drunken spirit. You got a brass bull in you, so use it. You remember... Uh, Kristen Paul? Hey, dickhead! Get the hell out of my friend's face before you start pissing me off. Jesus, you, you don't have to raise your voice at me. I know when I'm not wanted, I can, I can read body languages. Where's the latrine anyway? See you later. See? Having an extra little bit of confidence can really help keep the sailing smooth down here. Or, you know, it can get the shit kicked out of you. Whichever side the coin lands on. But like I was saying, grass bulls tend to make people a little ordinary. But try different drinks for different results. Christ, they sound like a fucking car commercial. T -t Tommy, are we having a rematch or have your balls not grown back yet? <laughs> hey, I'm coming over there, all right? Nice meeting you kids. Crap, we should. We're missing our chance. We should go ask him, right? I mean, he's our ticket upstairs to Sam and uh, her info. Okay, let's get him. I thought we were friends. How could you not tell me? Why would I need to tell you dolls can't really talk? Can it, you two? I warned you once already. One more outburst, you and everyone near you are getting their feet nailed to the top of Mount Vasectomy. Oh, wait. Maybe we should just egg those two idiots on. The bouncer will have to deal with it, and then we can go upstairs. The bouncer will have to... How do you even know that'll happen? Doesn't that seem like... Hey, fellas. Beer pong, huh? Uh, my, my dorm room was next to the guy who won his league tournament. That's awesome. You know what would be even more awesome? If he could stop talking and never start again. Hey, now. Artesia's consumer of negligent fathers. That's not cool. Milo, right? You want to play around? It's really simple. <laughs> Easy to learn, hard to master, right? I've, uh, never played before. Is it like normal Pong? Because in that, the ball bounces back. You catch on quick. Did you die drinking bleach thinking it was just really painful water? Uh, look, it's easy. Lola, okay. You and me, Bright Eyes. I'm going to wreck you. Lola, do you want to, uh, to play? Uh, yeah, sure. Might as well learn Blood Pong while I can still say I'm new. Gather round, everyone. This chickadee thinks she's a rooster already. Well, I eat people who eat roosters for breakfast. Ooh. Hey, all right. You make more well-wishers with honey than with vinegar. <laughs> no, it's okay, guys. We really pride ourselves on our ability to trash talk down here. It's like, even if you lose, if you got in a few verbal jabs along the way, a few witty rejoinders. Yeah, should take your shot, shithead. Or we can just call each other names, you know, whichever's faster. Oh, are you chicken now? Should we bring out the oven, get a roast going? If I could feel bad about anything, I'd almost feel that for you. You're, uh, you're going down, ass, asswipe. Fuck. You can do it! Yeah. Does your family know you're this bad at this? Because someone should tell them. Why, why bother? He'll probably just like miss. Come on. 
Come on, Lola. Which angel's ass did you tickle for that one? You... You're just bad at this. Eat my shit, goddammit. Lola, let's go. You'll get it next time. <laughs> Picture victory, and victory will be yours. Typical. Enjoying this yet? You can do it, Lola. Nice. If I had a controller, I'd throw it. Lola, it's all you. you got this. Good try. Boom shakalaka. Boom. What did I tell you, huh? Humans are good for two things. Beating them in beer pong and eating their babies. A dick for brains. I wasn't even trying. What do you think about that? What do I think about it? I think I can smell a liar when they're a cat fart away from me. It was, uh, nice meeting you, Milo, Lola. <laughs> Work on those comebacks. I'll be around. Ah, oh, shit. We're getting freezed out. It's like Marcy's birthday all over again. Except without the E. coli outbreak. Let's just see what else is going on. <sighs> Okie dokie. Uh, barkeep? What's, uh, on the menu this morrow's eve? A fine selection, let me tell you. A pair of anguish. Is it good? Don't ask me, I just work here. Girly, what's your poison? Uh, just same as him, I guess. Uh, I thought, don't the demons torture the humans? How come everyone's just hanging out like it's happy hour at Chili's? Look, nobody here wants to be doing what they're doing. It's a job, and people understand that. Most people. And when your shift's over, you drink with whatever dangling eyeballs in front of you. The nicer ones, anyway. I don't know why, but it makes this somehow even more depressing. I thought we were friends. How could you not tell me? Why would I need to tell you dolls can't really talk? Can it, you two? I warned you once already. One more outburst, you and everyone near you are getting their feet nailed to the top of Mount Vasectomy. Oh, wait. Maybe we should just egg those two idiots on. The bouncer will have to deal with it, and then we can go upstairs. The bouncer will have to... How do you even know that'll happen? Doesn't that seem, like, advanced? Hey, whatever you want to do. I'm just a uh, squirrel trying to... Trying to. Oh, never mind. I'll follow your lead. <laughs> Dick. <laughs> okay. Hey, uh, guys, have, having a problem over here? Because maybe we can exacerbate the issue into a real disturbance. I mean, uh, help with whatever your thing is. Look, if you work here or something, relax. I'm not going to get into a fist fight with this asshole. I've been kicked out of enough bars in hell to know the punishment's almost never worth it. I didn't think you'd take it so seriously. How could I not take it seriously? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, we don't work here. Do I look like I work here? 
Don't worry about Danny, okay? He's just a little steamed because he found out his favorite stuffed animal from childhood. Georgie! <laughs> right, Georgie. The talking platypus. Well, he could only talk because I was possessing it all the time. And you don't think that's a betrayal? It was a joke. I'm happy to see you, man. I don't know you, man. Wait, I'm confused. The demon was your doll? What's happening? Okay, look, I had like two months shore leave saved up. So and... he decides to inhabit a little boy's doll. I got sent to an institution because no one would believe me. I still can't take a piss without carrying a spork for protection. Okay, okay, calm down. I don't want the bouncer taking any of my good organs. And anyways, you asked me to staple your baby sister's feet to the floor. I was six years old. I thought the Easter Bunny was real. I, I, I didn't comprehend what was going on. Uh, do either of you know Thomas by chance? Maybe get us on his death day list? You want to go upstairs. The door's right there. Uh, with a very large demon blocking it. So can you uh, just... Look, I just came over to say hi, okay? And I don't hold any bad feelings about you plunging that crucifix into my felt and cutting off my vacation early. You don't have any bad feelings? You don't have any! Keep it down, guys, or I'm coming over there. And you're not gonna like it when I do. Man, friendships, huh? <laughs> Makes you wonder why they're not called friend slips, right? Because they're hard to... They're hard to keep a hold of. <laughs> uh, this isn't going anywhere. We'll just see you guys around. What you're gonna see is my foot up this guy's ass is what you're gonna... Oh, hush. Yeah, uh, we didn't exactly get them to cause a scene. Did we? But if you want to keep poking the beehive... Ah, uh, no, maybe we should try your thing. Talking to Tommy, just getting on the list. Whatever you want to do. Hi again. Yeah, hi. Danny, what do you want me to say, huh? <laughs> I'm sorry for making everyone think you wrote those messages in blood on your mom's bathroom mirror, all right? Don't laugh. This shit isn't funny. <laughs> okay, okay, that's... I'm sorry, but it's funny. Danny, come on, you have, to, you have to have a sense of humor about these things. What things? It was a possessed toy destroying my life! <laughs> you should have seen what I wrote. That's it, you giant sack of shit! You're gonna regret making me love you! I mean, the drowning that farmer's kid! You'll never make me regret that! Hey, guess what, guys? You won. Wanna know what you win? No. Ten years in the throat cutter, and it hasn't been washed in centuries. But it'll be <laughs> dirty! Hey, Van Dyke. Where's uh, the nearest singles bar? Hey, my plan worked. The bouncer left. Let's head upstairs, talk to Sam before he comes back.